Hey guys, so today I wanted to do kind of a little reflective vlog, just talking about my life and stuff that's going on and everything. Um, as you guys know, I am going to college in the fall, so that's a big change, and all my friends are also going to college this year. So it's just kind of interesting now that it's summer and everyone's graduated, people are kind of getting ready to go and getting ready to move out of Texas or, um, you know, to go to different cities in Texas or wherever they're going to school. And it's just really interesting kind of thinking back on my whole high school years and everything that happened kind of in the time of me being a teenager, I guess. And I still am a teenager, but I don't know. I feel like once you get to college, you're just in like a different phase of your life than you are in high school, at least in my opinion. Um, so it's just kind of interesting to kind of reflect back on all of that and think about it. I definitely think that for my friends that are going out of state and stuff, it's going to be sad and, you know, we're all going to be separated. But I think when you really have, like, good friends, you can go, and I've had this, you know, you can go for times without seeing each other, times without talking to each other. And then when you meet back up, you kind of pick up right back where you started. I and mean, at least that's how it is with a lot of my friends, you know, having that after I left the high school and then started doing the online schooling, I didn't see them every single day at school anymore, but every time we would see each other, it still was like we were just as good friends as we were before. So that's kind of how I look at it when people are going to be going off to college and moving and just leaving, and I kind of feel like they'll have time to go somewhere new and grow and meet new people and all go meet new people and all grow and then when we come back home we kind of start back where we were so that's kind of how I think of it um, but I know a lot of people say you know that's the really like the hardest part about going to college and stuff is just leaving your fa like your friends and your family and just all that change and so I'd love to hear what you guys think about that because obviously I haven't gone through it yet but I think I can definitely handle it and I kind of I've already had that mindset, I guess, with my friends, so that part of it, I just feel calmed about that, and I'm also, like, for the really close friends that I have, I've never really, like, lost a friend, I guess, we normally just grow apart, it's not like, I don't really have any friends that I've, like, completely lost, just in a big fight or anything like that, so that's nice, um, so I guess, yeah, I guess we'll just see, you know, who kind of grows apart and does their own thing. For the most part, I think we'll all stay pretty close, and so I'm happy about that, but of course, a little bit nervous. I mean, just starting over, it's interesting, and it's really weird thinking back on everything. It's not to say that things that happened previously don't matter, but I just feel a lot more resolved and calm about them. I know there were some different incidents with some people that I knew and some of my friends that, you know, maybe were like more negative at the time that now I kind of feel okay about and I don't feel upset about and I think that's obviously just growing up but I hope you know college is kind of like that too I hope people kind of have that same mindset that they kind of just let the grudges go and kind of let you know problems that you had in the past go and kind of just focus on like your true good friends and who's truly there for you um I also have had a lot of questions about Justin and I so I thought I would go ahead and just kind of answer them quickly so basically the last time we broke up which was uh, like January we broke up and as you guys know we had broken up previously before that and then we got it together and then we broke up again so this last time that we broke up was the final time we broke up um, and the first time we had broken up you know it was a lot more dramatic and it was so like heartbreaking and you guys know I made the videos you know my heartbreak video and just you could tell how emotionally like fragile and just how upset I was and it was like, you know, it was my first love and I had never gone through that before. But now, looking back on that, like, I'm so glad that that is on YouTube. And I know a lot of people are like, that's so weird that you'd want to, like, have a video of yourself crying, like, for the world to see. But I just look back at that video and I see the pain that I felt then and I just feel how much strength it's actually given me now. And it's just a really cool, like, thing to feel, I guess. But I can only feel that now because I'm looking back on it and like now I'm okay with it if that makes any sense so you know I just want you guys to know if you are going through a breakup of especially like your first big breakup your first love it does get better it just it takes time and that's really the only thing that will heal it is just time and you know letting yourself get over it naturally and letting it kind of um I guess like fade back into your mind I feel like that sounds so weird but anyways so this last time we broke up we actually um had previously discussed before we even broke up that we weren't going to be doing the same thing next year. Um, we didn't plan on going to the same school, we didn't plan on going to the same school at the same time, nothing like that. We pretty much knew like come college we're probably not going to be together so you know 
if we were going to do something long distance or whatever, it would just be really hard and it was kind of fair to both of us to kind of start fresh and like be able to be single when we're um, going off to college and starting just a whole new phase of your life. And looking back on it now, like for me and for him and I, that was the right thing. You know, we had grown up together. We had a lot of really amazing experiences. You know, we both went through um, Ben passing away together. We just had so much stuff like in our relationship that was really strong and really um, like meaningful. Like he was my best friend, but you know, from him I grew a lot and I feel like I also gained a lot of knowledge, you know, I realized things that I really liked about him and I also realized things that just didn't work with him and I in our relationship and so now I just feel like I have so much more wisdom and insight and I know, you know, obviously I still don't know everything, I mean I'm only 17, but I am learning and so I just want you guys to know if you are at a place in your life where you feel really confused and you feel like you know, you're just lost and nothing's really working out or lining up, it does. It just takes a little bit of time and I'm really happy that I'm finally at that point where I feel so calm and excited for the future and, you know, I'm excited to be, like, single and, like, do my own thing and just, I don't know, it's something that, like, a year ago, two years ago, I would have thought, you know, I would have been so upset if him and I weren't going to the same school, you know, I'd be dreading this, blah, blah, blah. But right now I'm actually really happy and I'm really just collected, I guess, in how I feel. So I hope you guys are doing well and I hope you kind of get this little rambly vlog. But I just wanted to kind of share what's going on in my life lately. And I'd love to hear what you guys think if you um, went to college with a boyfriend or, you know, you and your boyfriend broke up before college, how that worked, you know, how you stay connected with your friends through going to college. I'd love to hear any of your comments and suggestions in the comments below. I go through those comments and I just read them for hours and it's amazing how much, like, advice and knowledge you guys give me and I really appreciate it. So I'm going to go ahead and go, but thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all soon. Bye everyone!